Teacher's secret pass gets her fine. What? Oh, she was the OnlyFans model. What happens next is shocking. What's this? Is my Chrome bugging? Hello? Riley, why don't you give it a shot? Oh, um... I don't know. That's totally okay. So first we're going to distribute what's outside of the parentheses. The what? And then we're going to... Wow. <laughs> what's going on, guys? Come on, no cell phones. Where did you get that? Huh? Miss Callahan, would you mind explaining the rest of the problem to me? Um, of course, Riley, sure. Chad, do we think it's only fans? Hey, sweetheart. Hey. Oh, she got mad. I'm glad it's only fans. Oh, it's some like uh, Kim Kardashian it's type shit. Again. Your kid. What? what do you do now? One of my students somehow has a photo of me in a bikini. It's from a long time ago, but Ricky is the only person who could possibly have something like that. What Ooh. is this guy's problem? He's got to get over this obsession that he has with you. You broke up, what, 10 years ago? Yeah. What are you going to do? For now, just pray things don't get Wait, is Slag one of them? Fuck. Worse? Come on. Just one kiss. Max, stop where it's Oh, cool. hell no. He's gonna see? Come on. Max, no! Stop it. You're such a- No prude. means no! Hey, Riley. Bro, let us see the fucking photo. Like, right, come on. Mrs. Callahan, a word? Nah, but really, listen, I don't think it's that bad, bro. Can you not, like, wear a bikini if you work in a school, bro? Like, it's not... The, the photo wasn't taken for the school. Also, why are these windows so fucking dirty? What the fuck? Hello? Like, darn man, fix your shit. Who would do this to you? It's my ex-boyfriend from high school. Every once in a while, he, he tries to come back into my life, and I don't let him, but it seems he's resorted to this now. Have you contacted the police? Yeah, I have, but because there's no way I can prove that it's him sending the photos, they say there's nothing they can do. Do you have an attorney? Do you know how much attorneys charge per hour? We're barely keeping up with rent. Mrs. Callahan, you're one of the best teachers we have here at Bookside. I really don't want to lose you. Wait. It is my job at risk? But but I haven't done anything wrong, and these are just photos of me. And Did you actually get fired from that? You're, you're fine for now. But if this situation escalates and parents get involved, it won't be good. My you advice can? to you is if you have That's a way weird. to get a hold of him or know where he is, get him to stop. Ain't no way he's a waiter, bro. Is that him? We're closed. Katie. Baby. Don't call me that. <laughs> Come on. For old times. You need to stop, Ricky. With all of it. With the photos, the harassment. You need to move on. It's been a decade. Let me live my life and go live yours. Katie, baby. That's not gonna happen. What the fuck? Why are you doing this? I've never done anything. Because, Katie. We you belong together. Home. We had a good thing going. And then you went and broke up with me. Okay, I am not here to talk about our high school relationship. I moved on a long time ago. And so should you. Just leave me alone. I mean it. Woohoo! Huh? So you can use the quadratic equation to help solve it. Oh, Makes God. so much more sense. Thank you. Can I ask you a question off topic? Sure. 
Do you think I should wear makeup? I heard some of the other girls saying I need to. Well, do you want to wear makeup? Not really. I'm not gonna lie. Not Unless you're like place. ugly, you shouldn't really well, need it, bro. Don't That's just my opinion, though. Convince you to do something that you're not comfortable with. If you want to wear makeup, then great. And if you don't, don't feel pressured just to fit in. Okay. Real shit. Can I ask another question? It's Who cares about more... makeup, bro? You should. And you're... wait, what? Why am I canceled now? Sensitive. I'd ask my mom, but she's not always the easiest to talk to. Um, my boyfriend Max. We've been together for over a year, and he's been pressuring me to do things I'm not really ready for. He said he's gonna break up with me if I don't. Huh? Riley, I can promise you, this is not the type of guy you want to be with. Someone who really cares about you will never make you do anything that you're not 100% comfortable with. Thanks, Mrs. Callahan. That's exactly what I needed to hear. Wait. Good. Why was that bad what I said, you know, bro? One of the reasons I wanted to become a teacher was to help young people avoid the kind of mistakes that I made while growing up. That's not what I said. That's all well and good, like, to make it feel, like, good for them. But I'm saying, in a good way, like, you don't need all that unless you're, like, man. So, you can come talk to me about anything, not just <laughs> quadratic equations. <laughs> Riley, what are you doing here? Oh. School let out 30 minutes ago. <laughs> Miss Callian was just helping me with something. Uh-huh. I don't want you spending time with this woman, what? especially not alone. What? Huh? I don't need my daughter hanging out with someone who presents themselves like this. Yo, whoa, hold on a minute. <laughs> Yo, can somebody, uh, you know, do your thing. Do your thing, please. Thank you. You literally said only ugly bitches wear makeup. I didn't mean to PTA, say it like that, bro. I believe I speak on behalf of all of the parents. When I say that you Mrs. Know what I Callahan meant. is not fit to be a member of the faculty here. Or anywhere else, for that matter. With all due respect, I am more than fit to be teaching here. Not only do I have all the credentials, but the students love working with me. No one spends more time helping these kids outside of class than I do. Regardless of your credentials, <clears throat> you are not the type of role model that we want our children exposed to. Lego mode's fine. I can't now wait to play it, bro. I'm I playing it soon. <clears throat> and I will find grounds for dismissal if need be. Principal Thompson, if you continue to allow her to teach here, then I'll simply notify the board. And that is not a very good look for Bookside. Bro, who actually be trying that hard, though? Or its principal. I'm so sorry, Mrs. Callahan. Damn. All right, class. Listen up. I am Mrs. Larson, your new teacher. I came from a boarding school, so you will all respect me. Hmm? All right. Now, who can solve this problem? Anybody? You? You? <clears throat> you. Get up there and solve the problem. Um, can you choose someone else? Um, I could, but I didn't. So get up there and solve the problem. It's four? Is it actually? Wait. Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Let me see the actual problem. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, what's the actual problem? Chill, 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 chill. We're actually about to work this out. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. What is it? I. Right. What the fuck is that? I ain't doing that. Fuck you. What number is that? Is that so, an eight? are you going to solve it? I'm sorry. I'm just kind of nervous. Mrs. Callahan never made us solve problems in front of the class. She usually just worked through them with us. Oh, well, in case you hadn't noticed, I am not Mrs. Callahan. I'll solve the problem. I'm going to say t 12. All right, class, since we're all being difficult today, I think it's time for a pop quiz. You go sit down. 
Chat, did you guys have teachers like this? I miss Mrs. Callahan. They would have got laughed at if that was in the UK. Holy. Hi, sweetheart. Your father told me that you finally broke up with Max. <laughs> and I'll tell you how happy I am. He was not the guy for you. You have one? No way. Glad you finally came to your senses. So how was school today? Do you like your new teacher? Not at all. She's horrible. Come on, Riley. She can't be that bad. No, you don't understand just how bad she is. I want Mrs. Callahan back. Everyone does. No. No, Riley. There is no chance I'm letting that woman near Bookside again. You'll get used to her. Just give it time. No. Oh. What a bitch, bro. Look, I'm sorry. I have to take this. It's my firm. Hi, yes, this is Amy. <laughs> hey, sweetheart. Everyone in my class calls her a <sighs> devil. That's insane. Oh, honey. How you doing, bro? Have you been in that same spot all day? I just feel like my life is over. <laughs> all I've ever wanted to do was teach. Hey, don't worry. It's all just gonna blow over. And you're gonna find a great new teaching gig like that. Just you watch. I don't know about that. Look. Katie Callahan of Bookside High School was recently fired after some of her racy photos were leaked. The photos were sent to students, members of the Yo, team, why are they blocking it, man? I can't believe that's on social huh. media. I, babe, I'm so sorry. Do you want me to go confront this guy myself? It's not gonna accomplish anything now. I just wish everyone knew the real story about what happened back then. Well, why didn't you tell them? I tried. The principal... No, no, no I'm, not, I'm not talking about the principal. I'm talking about... everyone. Free TikTok video, here we go. Do you see these quizzes? F. Oh, F. And hey, look, another F. Woohoo! How you... Ever made it to the tenth grade? Oh, okay, oxygen. Beyond me, there is one place where these quizzes belong in the trash. Oh, hold on. There is one place where these quizzes belong in the trash. I cannot believe a teacher would actually speak to her students this way. She needs to go now. You're right. That is unacceptable, but it is hard to find teachers these days. We're at the mercy of the substitutes we can get until we find a permanent replacement. How long? This is my daughter's future we're talking about. Month? Up to a year? A year? No way. I want Mrs. Callahan back. Please. No, right. Are there really like not that, that many is teachers not even like a that? Question. She chose to behave inappropriately. It wasn't her fault. What are you talking about? She made a TikTok explaining everything. You didn't see it? No, because we're like 50. <laughs> hey everyone, uh, my name is Katie Callahan. I'm the teacher that recently went viral for getting fired from Bookside because of some old photos. So I thought I'd get on here and explain my side of the story because this could really happen to anyone. You see, Oh, here we my go. My parents moved us to California my sophomore year. I was a shy kid and I never had a lot of friends. So I was pretty relieved when the senior invited me over to his table on what the first the day of my new school. He kind of looked like uh... Before long, we started dating. I was so excited. Shout who does he look I'd like? I never had a boyfriend before. Or even a lot of friends, to be honest. He I looks like, like Shane Dawson, bro. Belonged. What I didn't know was what would happen next. Ricky started pressuring me to do things I did not want to do. Like cutting class. What? Or stealing things. Or even drinking alcohol. Woohoo! 
I would say no to try to get out of it, but he'd keep insisting. I felt trapped. So for some time, I said yes to things that I now regret. Oh, hell no. What's up, Sai? How we doing, bro? After a while, I yo, finally came to my yo, senses we're and broke up with him. <laughs> uh, but that did not go so well. Wait, what the fuck? I pressed the wrong button. My bad. I'm tired as fuck. You good, bro? He tried to retaliate Justin against is crazy. every chance he got. <laughs> Justin Beam. Even until this day. Wait. Hold on. Stay. That's fine. <sighs> so you see, I got pressured into doing things that I never wanted to do. And it still hurts me to this day. And that's a big reason why I became a teacher in the first place. I just wanted to help young people avoid the same mistakes that I made. Because Yo, chill out, man. Chill out, chill out, man. Chill out, chill out, chill out. Lifetime. <sighs> As it's doing to me. I don't know. I mean, is she a good teacher? Yes. But do I want her giving life advice to my daughter? I think she gives amazing advice. Who do you think convinced me to break up with Max? <sighs> Mom, Max was trying to pressure me into doing things that I wasn't ready for. And... Who would convince you to date a guy that's him? named Max anyway, I though? probably would have. Your TikTok's getting a lot of positive responses. I don't think I even know a Max. Yeah. But it's not changing The only anything. Max that comes to my mind is the racist well, guy. <laughs> would it make you feel any better if I told you I'm making... Breakfast for dinner! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah! <laughs> okay. I'll get it. Pre-ABC uh, news at the door. Or the teacher. Oh! This is Brown. What are you doing here? Hi, Katie. Riley showed me the video that you did. And I am so sorry that you had to go through all that growing up. It was really wrong. Thanks. And she also told me that you were the one that convinced her to break up with Max. What's up, C2? Her father and What's I up? have been trying to get her to we do good? that for a very long time. But for some reason, she listened to you. What's she waffling about? As do all the other kids, I'm told. Katie, you really are a wonderful teacher. Former teacher. About that, I spoke to the principal. And Bookside would love it if you came back. Oh, my bad. If you're still interested. <laughs> interested? Woohoo! <laughs> These kids are my life. <laughs> But I'm not sure it's such a good idea. I don't know what my ex is going to do. And I can't stop him. Yes, About you that. Can. What? Because you happen to be the favorite teacher of a young girl whose mother is an attorney. Oh, of course she fucking is. <laughs> of course she is. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Hey, full circle, man. Wait, I think Welcome I know where I recognize the head teacher. Hold we on. We missed you. I missed you guys too. <laughs> Wait, hold on. I'm going to show you after. Hold on. Excuse me. Are you Richard Smith? Yeah. I represent Katie Callahan. And if I were you, I would stop doing what you're doing. Because you are liable for all of the damages you've caused. Wait, what is that? Season this is? And you wouldn't want to make your situation even worse now. Would you? Okay. Hey, that was kind of fire, bro. Hold on, wait. I want to go back to where the head, head teacher was, bro. I think I recognize her, bro. Wait. Oh, you guys are so... 
All right, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, I might be, I might be bugging. Hey, hey, wake up, huh? you imbecile. The meeting begins in 10 minutes and you're sitting here asleep. No, I'm sorry. I, I was up all night preparing. Is that her? I don't know. It might actually be her, bro. It might actually be her. All right. Anyway, it's not. Okay, never mind. You know what? Just, just. Can we just say yes, just so I feel good, bro? 